Hello all, this is the seventh session on 3D modeling using Onshape. Uh, in the last video, we introduced a sweep feature in the 3D modeling and we modeled a handrail using the sweep feature. In this video, we are going to uh, do a helical spring with the um, N hooks. Okay, the spring will be like this and we will start the modeling. We can start a new part studio. I will select the top plane for sketching. I will just draw a circle of diameter 60. I'll finish my sketch then I'll, I'll go to the helix okay. feature toolbar you can see at the end a plane menu is there click on that you can select the helix okay when you select the helix the first drop down menu you can select turns and pitch then we have the circular edge for the circular edge you will select this circle okay and and the helical pitch we are doing is 20 so i'm just reducing the total revolution to 10 okay okay so a helix is now formed all right i just want to do the profile for sweeping. I'll select the front plane for sketching. I'll just make a circle with diameter 10 mm. I'll go to the uh, constraint menu select piercing okay. select the center point of the circle select the helix so you can see it is pierced now you can check the sketch now you can go to the sweep function click on the sweep It will be a solid new and the face will be the circle. The sweep path you can select the helix. So the basic portion of the spring is finished. Now we want to make the end hook. Okay. To make the end hook, I just want to define a new plane which is parallel to the top plane and it is offset. So I'll select the plane. I'll select top plane. I'll go here. Plane point I will select. Okay. You can enlarge and click this point. So you can see a new plane is there. Then I'll select a new sketch on the plane one if I click view normal and I'm going to make a arc here first okay for that I'm going to select center point arc okay center point arc from the arc menu I'll first mark the center which is in line with the center and I'll select this point from there I'll draw I'll make it somewhere here okay then I'll go for the dimensioning we'll make it as 15 so just finish that so you can see okay so now I will go 
So I will finish the sketch. I will go to the right plane for a new sketch. So I will go again for the arc with center point. I will select the point. Center point will be here. It should be collinear with the center of the coil. Okay. You can make it like this. Right. Then you can make a dimension. Make it as 30. Okay. All right. Then you can finish the sketch. Now you can again go to the sweep feature, select the sweep, click on the profile at the end of the coil, in the sweep path you can click this and this. Finish the sweep. The same way you can do on the opposite side also. Hope you enjoy my video. Welcome to the next session. Thank you.